Everybody, how's it going? My name is Stanley. Welcome everybody to Akiba's Beat. I played Akiba Strip, and it was actually a really, really fun game. And this one seems like it's going to be a take, a slightly different take on Akiba's uh, series, I guess. I know they, this is a third game within the series. I know I played the first, played the second. It was really, really fun. Absolutely awesome. I'm guessing this one's going to be more musical oriented. Oh, playing that again. Let's skip that. <laughs> Never mind. I guess the game is just trying to get us to uh, hurry up as soon as possible. Let's go ahead and actually get into this. Let me just make sure everything is good. Uh, voice. Oh, God. We can actually choose multiple texts. Let's do English. And, uh... Dude, dude, yep. For uh, voice, we'll try some English voice acting to see how it's like. I don't know if it's any good, but the Akiba's uh, triple English voice acting was not too bad. So uh, let's begin the game. Begin the game, everybody. Tech speed. Let's do. Um, okay, let's do tech speed a little bit faster on the, on the faster side. Good. Uh, difficulty. We'll stick with normal. That's fine. Looks like there's easy, normal, hard, and imagine. Not sure what imagine is. Camera normal. X camera normal. Background volume. We'll keep on uh, medium. Uh, voice over volume, we'll keep on loud. Uh, sound effect volume, we'll keep on medium. I think that's fine. Yeah, we'll keep on medium. And then voice over volume, we'll keep on loud. Alright, I think that's about it. Let's start the game. You can uh, change, uh, start the game with the settings. You can change settings and gameplay. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? Let's give it a go. I'm excited to see what this is going to be like. <sighs> let's do this. The night sky is a tapestry of shooting stars, each bearing a wish upon it. But what are those wishes? People wish for money. They wish for love. Some wish to change the future, others the past. But could you really call such absurd hopes wishes? What we call wishes are, well, nothing more than delusions. That's not to say one should feel guilty for indulging in them, of course. Each and every human is, at his or her core, a being who dines on delusion. <laughs> no, that's not quite right. Please allow me to rephrase. Humans are the only beings capable of self-delusion. In a way, that's a power, one granted exclusively to the human race. Delusions allow people to wallow in their most idealized, impossible dreams, free from reality. In fact, it can be said without a shred of hyperbole that this is man's single true joy. But humans, oh, they are well aware that their delusions do not in any way represent reality. And perhaps, that is the most tragic indictment one could make of reality. But that's precisely the reason delusions exist. The reason they serve the function they serve. And yet, and yet, what if a delusion were to suddenly become real? Could you think of anything more wonderful? That, ladies and gentlemen, is the reason I exist. Now, draw the curtain. Indulge in a spectacular delusion that transcends your wildest dreams. Oh. Beginner's Delusion Floor 1. Okay, that just jumps us right into this. I'm so far a fan. Whoever the oh, God, I forgot I forgot the person's name, but that the uh, the voice actor is actually really good. I heard of me before in the past. Okay, so left stick, run around, right stick to uh, to turn. Gravity freaking jump, that's crazy. Alright, that's kinda neat. Uh circle does nothing. Square is the light attack. Nope, it's just the attack. Uh bumpers do nothing. Click and six does nothing. D-pad does nothing. Okay, let's go and begin. Tutorial level. Oh, now where might this be? I wish I knew. I really wish I knew. Encounter. Okay. No problem. Movement. Push left sick right or left to close in on the enemy. Or put some distance between you. You play video games, you know this, I'm glad- <laughs> I love this game, it just says, You do down the song and dance, you know what to do, come on, this is easy. Move away, away from the enemy, yeah, that's no problem. Uh, run button makes run, uh, uh, run man r wait, wrong game. But if you can hold the free run button to throw freely around the battlefield with left stick, okay. L1 and uh, stick is free run, okay, gotcha. So it's a little bit like Tales of Zestiria and Berseria, a little bit. 
Press the attack button to strike enemies with regular attacks. Uh, chaining these attacks will create a combo. You will need combos. Combos for days! <laughs> I already love this game. The fact that it's so well localized. Combos for days! Alright, let's do it. Let's get the four attack combo. Good. Not bad. Moving attack, press the attack button while pushing the left stick or left or right to perform a moving attack. Now get moving, alright? Okay, kinda cool, I like that. Rising attack, press the attack button while pushing the left stick up to perform a rising attack. Rise up, alright? Not, so not bad. Perform four attack, okay, four like combo. Gotcha, alright. Press the attack uh, button. Uh, press the attack button while pushing the left stick down to perform low attack. Keep the enemies on their toes. I'm pressing the button, but for some reason it starts moving first. I'm not really sure why. I think it might be a slight delay in controls, maybe? I don't know. Uh, press the uh, skill button to, uh, to scale. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> press the skill button to scale. Wow. You can mix them into your combos and assign them to specific combinations of left, uh, left stick plus skill button or right stick via the menu. Alright, perform a skill three times. Okay. Uh, mastering the basics, now that you know the basics, the enemies will start fighting back. So use what you've learned to take him down. Okay. You like this? Okay. Okay, we have so, so many combos we can use here. We can dodge. Okay, I can at least free run a little bit more side skill. We can reposition ourselves a little bit better. Ow. Ow, okay. Can be a little bit rough. Looks like the enemy will always auto attack onto my direction, or we can dodge around. Nice. All right, this is actually not too terrible. There's a weird delay between the controls. I don't know what it is. It's like slight, such a uh, slight stiffness. I'm not sure if this game was designed for PS4 or whether this was a Vita port. I'm not really sure, but nevertheless, getting the controls. I'm liking the tutorial. It's very nice. This we got an enemy here. Illusion all its own. Probably is. Although I do like the colors here. Look really, really vibrant. Encounter. I'll blow you away. Guarding. Press the guard button to get guarding. Guarding against the enemy attack will reduce the damage you take from it. Obviously. <laughs> Obviously. Okay, guard three attacks. Sounds good. We could do that. All right. Strafing. While guarding, you can strafe around the enemy while pushing left stick in any direction. Show the fancy footwork. Okay, so that's actually very similar to uh, Berseria. I like it. I actually really like it. Oop. Not bad. Gotta just time it just right though. Oh, time it poorly here. Okay, hold on, hold on. Back, 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 back. There we go. Dang it, the other, the other character attacking us is a little bit rough. I have to make sure I'm watch out for both of them. There's a, there's a slight delay in the, in the uh, movement, which is why it's a little bit weird. There's a little a slight delay, it's weird. Press the designated button while guarding to jump. Okay, circle and... X, I guess. Press the detonate button while guard to jump. You can use the left stick to jump forward or backward as well. And boy, oh boy, is Asahi a good jumper. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, I see what it is. I'm not sure what we're gonna do with the jump though. Target nearby enemies. I'm not really sure what a jump is supposed to do for us, honestly. I think it's supposed to be able to dodge out of the way with a jump. I'm not really sure. Uh, target nearby enemies. You want to target enemy? Well, press that target button. Dang it. R1. Okay, sounds good. Okay, choosing a target, press and hold the same button to cycle through enemies and target the one you want to fight. Then go fight it, go on, do it. I wonder if I can use the D-pad for this stuff, actually. Now that I think about it. No, I cannot. I have to use the stick for this stuff. Dodging. Okay, we can target this way. Oh. Oh, right stick. Okay, right stick will let us target. Okay, good, gotcha. Fighting it out, using also guarding, strafing and jumping to take these enemies out and defeat them. I believe in you. Alright, thank you for, uh, believing me. Appreciate it. Okay. Do you think? Oh god. Keep attack keep press keep pressing the attack button, it's just not doing it for some reason. I guess I gotta hold it down all the way. Yeah I It's weird. I'm pressing okay, yeah, I'm pressing the button, right? I'm pressing the button and I'm Huh? <laughs> I was pressing square and the character was running to them. I'm not really sure why. I I'm not I'm not really 100 percent sure, but I was actually holding uh, holding down the attack button and holding down, and the character was just running to them. <laughs> not sure what's going on there. Oh well. 
And looks like we can exit. That's a, that was a little bit weird. I need to. I want to. Do, I want to practice that a little bit. See if that's a just a thing that happens. I was a little holding on the attack button, right? The light attack that's button, fast. and a holding down on on the um, on the stick. And for some reason, the character was moving forward. I don't know. Beginner's delusion escape F uh, two floor or second floor. Let's go here. Okay, we got okay. Good, we got more enemies to try to break against. I'm gonna have to nail that down and see what that's or all about. Is this reality? I don't know if it is. Let's go and take it on. Okay. No problem. Battle menu. Press the designated menu to open the menu, allowing you to use items, set up skills, or tactics. Or if you was retreat. Wow. Battle menu. You got items. What do we have, if anything? Asahi Tachibana. Okay, that's us. Uh, we have no consumables whatsoever. Looks like we're gonna have a party of four in total. Not bad. We can escape. Tactics. Target, nearest, behavior, freestyle, will fight according to the instinct. HP cost reckless, SP cost willy, <laughs> willy skilly. I like that. And auto item, use it. All right. And skills. What kind of skills we got here? Ember's Edge, Ember's Edge, Ember's Edge, Ember's Edge. Okay, so that's the only actual skills we got. Okay, so it's actually very similar to the. Uh... Oh, we got White Six skills as well. Interesting. Wait, White Six. How, how are we going to be able to use White Six? I don't get it. Huh? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Can I? Oh, wait, can I just have everything on a right stick for combos? I mean, I need to try that. I need to try that. A real bad here. Finding it out. Secure the adventure combat by level. Uh, uh, leveraging the few item skills and tactics currently available to you to defeat your enemies. Okay. Okay, we can actually use the right stick to. Uh, okay, we can use the right stick to uh, deal with the enemies. All right, that's actually kind of neat. We can use them for skills. What does jump do have get for me? I don't get it. Oh, okay, I guess it's gonna let me uh deal with the enemy a little bit. Not bad. Okay, not bad. Okay, good. Why is it why is it not combat not working? Oh now it's working. <laughs> it's like the hold on, it's like the combat feels a little sluggish. I don't I don't really understand. It's not as responsive as I hope it would be. It's kinda weird. Maybe it's something you just gotta get used to. Well, that didn't work out so well. Come on. Gotta dodge way ahead of time there. <laughs> I can't do a time right. I have to dodge ahead of time because I can't I can dodge right as attacks. There's a weird delay. I don't know what it is. It's like a really, really weird delay. I hope it's something I can calibrate later. Can I calibrate here? No, I can't. It's only pauses. Uh, menu? Nope. Nothing. No, it's nothing. Let's keep going then. Hopefully I can adjust a little bit later. Which do you wish it to be? Uh, I don't know. Let's attack it, though. Okay, what do we got here? Uh, acing the basics. You've made it through the tutorial, but don't pay yourself, pat yourself on the back until you've beaten the one final enemy. Afterwards, you may pat away. <laughs> okay, game. Thank you. Okay, yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to just dodge abilities ahead of time. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Oh. Block, block, block. There you go. Okay, there we go. Yeah, the combat is really, really weird. <laughs> Slightly delayed and laggy in some parts. I don't know. I guess, I, like I said, I think it's just something I need to recalibrate. Oh, keep pressing the wrong button. Let's go. There you go. Nope, looks like we got more here. Oh, let's get them going then. Delusion and reality stand on either side of you. Who is this guy here? Let's go talk to him real quick. Welcome to the interstice between reality and delusion. Here, whether you exist within reality or delusion is merely a matter of perspective. So, shall we commence? Shall we descend into this delusion that presents itself as reality? And this reality that seems an illusion? Sure. <laughs> sure, I guess. We'll try it. Save for progress. Uh, okay. <laughs> I like how the other option is just nah, it's whatever. Nah, don't save it. It's whatever. Who cares? This game is pretty... Pretty memeified, in my opinion. <laughs> the encroachment of delusion. 
<sighs> I'm, I'm sensing a theme here. A lot of delusion-based themes. Let's keep it going then. Oh. Crap, crap, crap! Damn hell ass crap! <laughs> wow! <laughs> crap, 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 damn hell ass crap! <laughs> well then. Way to introduce our character very <laughs> cheerfully. I am so late! Mizuki's gonna chew my head off! And I'm gonna need that to read the early copy of the latest weekly chop he got for me, too. I gotta get over to Junk Street like yesterday! Oh my god. <laughs> Counter control with left stick, pause, up menu, world map, circle, access, jump, and I... Press the button without, no without doing anything. Check this. Is this a save point? It is a save point. Okay, gotcha. Let's go ahead and save it over why not. Just gonna go ahead and override it. Alright, so save point. It's gonna be like Tales of Berseria, where certain areas are gonna be save points. Okay, so it's gonna be that kind of an RPG. Nice. I kind of like that, actually. Uh, this is a... Apart I'm guessing it's an apartment or something. It looks pretty fancy. This guy's speeding on a hundred miles away. There we go. We can actually walk around. It doesn't look too terrible. It kind of dimly lit, in my opinion, but uh, let's keep walking then. Let's go to town. Junk Street, that's what we have to get over to. Junk Street. We'll try to use the map for that to see if you can explore a little bit. Oh, it's like uh, it's like uh, Akiba's Beat, where it's... Well, actually, no, this time around, only some people are silhouettes. Huh, I'm not sure if that's a budget constraint or what. Uh, map, we cannot even pull up a map. Cannot do anything except jump. Got like a gravity jump. Look so many times this isn't a joke. Who, who are they talking about? Oh, they probably talk comes bursting over in here. Alright, just keep on going then. Oh! Ah, there's nothing like Akiba on a Saturday. It's a madhouse, sure, but it's my madhouse. Oh, hello, Master. Allow me out, Mike Musameda, to welcome you to this fine establishment. <laughs> we got a cat girl made, everybody. We got a cat girl made. I wonder how you hide the hut, by the way. I literally have no idea how to hide the hut, I need to look this up and uh, see, if, see if I can hide the hut for some thumbnails. <laughs> but we got a calculator, everybody. Win this game officially game of the year. Uh, what? Sorry, but I'm kind of in a hurry here. It'll only take a meowment, I swear. I represent Neon Dreamin', a cat ear cafe which opens tomorrow. Oh my god. <laughs> the, the, the meows in the warning? Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so weird to listen to, but it's actually kind of funny. And purr, 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 purr oh my god. Presenting oh my god. Our grand opening special. Only 222 yen per drink. It's a steal. Oh my god. Uh, but two, two thousand twenty, uh, two hundred twenty-two yen per drink is not too terrible. I think roughly it translates to about two thousand thirty cents. I think. Oh, here, take this flyer as a souvenir. Oh my God. Yeah, uh, thanks. Wait, didn't this place used to be a bunny ear cafe like a month ago? <laughs> that was then. This is now. Bunny ears are way out, and kitty ears are super duper in. <laughs> <laughs> the way she talks, it's just like, oh, it's amazing, it's wonderful, it's absolutely wonderful. But yeah, she's right, Bunny Ears, who cares about those? Cat ears are in. Oh, hell yeah, I am totally on board with that. Man, Akiba doesn't waste any time replacing little pop-ups like this, does it? It's kind of brutal. Yeah, whatever, I can't complain. Yeah. Can we call? Crap, it's Mizuki. It, hello? Don't you hello me? You kept me waiting for two hours. Any sane person would have left ages ago. Two hours? Jeez. S sorry. Wow, we a dick. Where are you anyway? Talking with a cab maid. Oh, I'm on my way, I swear. Sprinting down the road as we speak. Be there in five. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that before. Five minutes. I'll be here, but I'm betting you won't. Yep, Mizuki is definitely not happy with me. Well, yeah, you kept waiting for two hours. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, but I gotta run. I've got a friend waiting for me. And I'll be waiting right here for you to return, Meowster. <laughs> <laughs> 
the answer. Oh my god. Well, we're coming back for her. We're coming back to visit her. The town map. You can open the town map by pressing the map button. Circle. Go into the mark point. We'll progress the main story. Okay. Sounds good. We'll be back for her. We're back for you, cat girl. Don't worry about it one bit. Oh my god. Even her. Even though her animations are <laughs> absolutely adorable. I love it. All right. So we have to go Station Plaza, UBX, I remember some of this stuff, Main Street, North, Junk Street, okay, yeah, I remember this now, this is the same layout as it was in Occupus Street, so we have to go over there, and this is a save point again, I'm not gonna worry about the save point for now, I'm gonna just head over to the next area, Station Plaza, I believe Junk Street was like the junky place on the side, I'm gonna have to use the map again just to make sure that I'm keeping up, keeping up with everything, what have we got here, posters for... Uh, Claris again, not sure what that's all about, but we got a bunch of ads here, which is actually kind of neat. Can go through some of them, check them out, let's go back to the map. We have to go to, looks like there's some street crossings we can take. Chunk Street is over on top left this way. Uh, let's head over to the main road, and we'll turn right and go up the street before we head out to the side. Please donate your blood, I, if I could I gladly would. It's weird that everybody else is a silhouette except the most important characters. I guess that makes sense, you know, for budget reasons, I guess. Let's go with this bit for now. We gotta go up here this way. Uh, we need to find a crossing. I believe a crossing is gonna be somewhere around here this way. So we can take that. Go through here. There we go. Now we should be on Main Street, I believe. I'm trying to remember the uh, Akiba's, uh, Akiba Strip uh, ma uh, map and everything and layout. Okay, we got some fancy schmancy ads on top. <laughs> well, yeah, this is Akiba like from, that <laughs> from the previous game, that's for sure. Let's keep going through here, and um, over, check, there you go. Okay, fast travel against this point, very nice. Uh, junk Street, Junk Street, Junk Street. Okay, we should be very close to here. Set up north, go up the street, and then make a left. And we should be there in a little bit. This is a pretty fancy map, I like it so far. Like what this game entails. Let's check what else is there. Loading screen is a little bit long though, in my opinion. And nothing over here. Ah, eh, just go to the event. There they are. There you are. Sorry. Only two. Only took two hours and five minutes. Do you have any idea how late you are? How long you kept me waiting? N no, I know. It's just that you know, on my way here, stuff happened. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, stuff. Okay, I'll play along. What sort of stuff happened today? We found love of our life, a beautiful, beautiful cat maid. <laughs> well, uh, I was talking to a maid. Ooh, there's that, and, um... Huh. So, maids before bros, huh? That's the game you're playing here? <laughs> Only the half cat ears. No, 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 that's not it. That is so not what I meant. <laughs> then by all means, elucidate. Okay, so first she just kind of called out to me, out of the blue. Then she was all, there's gonna be a cat at your cafe opening tomorrow. Yeah, I'm a cat. <laughs> oh. 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 oh my god. I feel like this game might be self aware. <laughs> it's just making fun of itself a little bit. And the Akihabara culture. Just, just a little bit. <laughs> Or the Otaku culture, I guess, not the like Habar culture. <laughs> I mean, you know. <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> it was beautiful. I, 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 uh... Here I was all ready to yell at you, and now you've got me laughing instead. It's not fair. Guess it's not too surprising, though. Against all odds, you've always had bizarrely good people skills. I have? Wait, does avoiding all contact with other people count as a people skill now? No. I mean it. You might not have ever noticed it, but you're good at interacting with your peers. I mean, you've had me waiting here half a day to give you this stupid magazine. Isn't that proof enough? Speaking of, take it. You've been dying to read this, right? Oh, it's so beautiful. The last issue left off on a killer cliffhanger. I've been waiting so hard for this. Thank you so much. It's no problem. It was on my way to work anyway. Which I'd be late for if you kept me waiting another 30 minutes. You'd still be hanging off of that cliff. Wait, you got work on a Saturday? Man, you're pretty much always working these days, huh? 
It suits you, though. Tutoring junior high kids, I mean. It's a very music -y thing to do. Well, what about you, Asahi? Any big plans today? Or are you gonna head home, read shop, and go to bed? We gotta see that cap made again, that's what we're gonna do. Hey, that plan is plenty big. And don't act like I don't have a life. I'll have you know there's more waiting for me than just chop. I've got anime and games to finish, too. In other words, you're gonna piss away the night with nerd stuff and go to sleep sometime tomorrow morning. Understandable. You say that like it's a bad thing. To some people, maybe, but I will not judge. <sighs> Still living the neat lifestyle to the fullest, I see. What can I say? I'm a career neat. It's my vocation, my passion, my one true calling in life. Oh my god. Such a waste. Hmm? What is? What indeed. Anyway, some of us have work. I've got to get going. Thanks again, Mizuki. See you later. You will. Bye-bye. Well, that's enough action for one day. I might as well head home myself. Are you kidding me? We come back- no, 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 no. We come back to that cafe, we see in our cat bay, we're ordering some 222 yen drinks. Come on, that's a steal. <laughs> I think. Pretty sure. <laughs> Pretty certain, actually. I don't know, I don't- I, I'm not familiar with yen currency as much as I am with dollar currency. And Twilight, never mind, maybe we do piss away the night. Okay. Well, let's see, what else we, we gotta run here? We should probably walk around the stores a little bit and see. Can we actually come back and check out the stores again? I wonder. Let's go back to Junk Street and see if we can actually visit the stores like we can in Akiba's Beat. No, not Akiba's Beat. Uh, Akiba's Strip. There we go. This is... This game is Akiba's Beat. The stores are there, but I don't think we can actually enter in. A lot of people stacking up here and just chilling. I guess nothing. We can go back and actually check it out the place for a little bit. You know, kind of see the sights and all that. See if there's anything specific new here. We could down head down south to the uh, side streets. See what's going on there. Might as well just kind of get the lay of the land, so to speak. Go through here. No reason to go this way. Never mind. We're not going that way. Let's go visit our capmate. See how she's doing. Right. That's. That, I think that's a pretty good idea, personally. I'm totally down for that. Let's do that. See how see. Let's see her before we get home. That's what I'm. That's what I say. Let's go over here. Very nice. There you go. So far, the layout is pretty much the same. I wonder if we can stop by the cafe from the first. It's not first game. Second game. Let's go by the cafe in the second game. We need to head upwards this way. I wonder if it allows to. No reason to go this way. Never mind. It won't let us to go to UBX. I'm not really sure what UBX stands for, but it's the place with uh, the Mogra Cafe from the uh, second game. Go through here. I wonder if there's gonna be a Mogra or similar place like that in this game. What else we got here? Let's see. Just wanna make sure we know exactly where to go. Looks like there's an event before we head home, so looks like there is something for us to do there. Aside from seeing, you no, know, our cat group mate, of course. You know, that's the most important thing ever. <laughs> So let's see what this event is like. Still, the loading screen is a little bit too long, in my opinion. Hello there. What's going on here? F save, I guess. Should save you just in case. Not sure what's going to happen up ahead, so let's go ahead and quick save just in case. There you go. Very nice. Wrong, wrong, wrong! Hmm? What's with this guy? It's all wrong! This isn't the way Akihabara is supposed to be! Say what now? Why'd Akihabara have to change so much? It used to stand for something, you know? It was an audiophile's paradise, filled to bursting with dreams, desires, and high-end audio equipment. It was? The heck's he talking about? But look at it now! It's a mess! Akiba today is all about anime and idols and all that other nonsense. Yep, this dude's nuts. Not the kind of person I should be engaging. Are Akihabara's audiophile days truly dead and buried, never to return? Oh, he just up and left without saying goodbye. Oh, where is my beloved district gone? Pretty sure in place like... Uh, Akihabara, they would have some sort of a music section, I would think. I mean, it does have a lot of entertainment stuff there, so I'm pretty sure music would be there somewhere. I'd better get home before this weirdo tries to talk to me or something. Ugh. Okay, we're gonna summarize him as a weirdo and just gonna avoid him. 
See you, weirdo. Let's go back to our cat mate. Hello there. How are you doing? Can we talk to her? No, we can't. Oh, no. We'll get back for you again. What is uh, what is her name? They even have a billboard for her, and she's like a... I guess a poster girl? I do like it. That's actually kind of cute. What, what is her name? We need to learn a little bit more. Cafe opens tomorrow if you don't come. I'll furnish you. Oh, my God. Oh, God. She's amazing. We'll be back for you, girl. We'll be back for you. Don't worry. We'll be back. We will be back. Let's get back to uh, the apartment, I guess. So the character is Asahi. Twilight and Night has a daytime cycle, so that's kind of neat. So what can we do here? We can save, or we can go ahead and head to bed. Really? Oh, doing something. I'm home! He said to nobody. <laughs> it's a little lonely. <sighs> what an exhausting day. And I haven't even done anything. Well... I think I'll kick things off with a power nap. It's not like I don't have time. Good night, Moon. Well then, a power nap. It's not midnight. Hmm? Who's calling me now? Hello? You just woke up, didn't you? Do you have any idea what time it is right now? Midnight? Oh, hey, Mizuki. Uh, morning. Wrong answer. It's almost midnight. That's about as far from morning as you can get. Oh, wow. Did I really sleep that long? Wait, why are you calling me at midnight? Did you need something? No, I don't exactly need anything. It's just that someone was so late earlier, I didn't get much chance to talk. Figured I'd remedy that now. So... Uh, does that mean there's something you wanted to talk about then? Are you seriously this dense? We've been friends since, what, grade school? Then all of a sudden you drop out of college and go full neat. Damn. Of course I want to talk. I'm worried about you. Are you eating right? Have you put any thought into your future? Miski's a good man. Okay, respectable. Well, sorry for worrying you. <laughs> But you'll be happy to know that I think about my future every day. I've got to find some way to be a neat forever. Oh my god. Are you serious right now? God. Just tell me you're eating food that, like, might actually be good for you. Um, uh, potatoes technically count as vegetables, right? They are. But how are you consuming the potato chips, potato fries? Because that would be terrible. Yeah, no. Guess I was right to be worried about you. Your health's probably a train wreck by now. Food is fuel, and have you ever seen a train wreck run like me before? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I take it you're gonna be free tomorrow, too? Hey, stop assuming I have no life. I mean, you're right, I am free, but that's beside the point. <laughs> <laughs> then let's go grab lunch together. We'll get something that'll actually be good for you for a change. Oh, you're treating? When do you get out of class? When do you want to meet? I was like, oh, you pay? I'll come. Wait, you do know I don't have school on the weekend, right? We're moments away from a Sunday, remember? I guess Anit wouldn't need to know what day it was anyway. No school on Sundays, right. I forgot. See, for me, every day is Sunday. I'm sure it is. Anyway, I'll shoot you an email with the time and the place. Deal? Roger that. I'll probably be up around noonish, give or take. If you're going to be late, let me know. Make me wait around again, and I'll bring the wrath of God down on you. Cool. I'll be waiting on your wake-up call, then. I'm not your mother. Okay, later. <laughs> mm, night, Mom. <laughs> Man, that music, he's always looking out for me. He's a regular guardian angel. Yeah, it'd be nice if you listened to him for a little bit. I don't think I eat that badly. But my future... Yeah, no idea what I'm doing there. I just don't want to work, ever. I want to be free to do what I want, when I want, how I want. Just like today. Speaking of, it'll be tomorrow any second now. Where'd I put that remote? Well, that was quick. Two o'clock by the FOSS map on Main Street. Go to bed now so you don't oversleep. I'm not your mother, he says. What am I, a grade schooler the night before a field trip or something? Come on. Well. Well then. He lives a very, very interesting life. His friend is just looking out for him. Come on. Mm -hmm. Did we oversleep? Who 
Who's calling at this hour? Why would anyone need to call me? Maybe it's your friend? Uh, why, hello, Mizuki. Isn't it just beautiful out today? <laughs> Don't you try to sweet talk me. Just how long did you plan on sleeping? Well, uh, what time is it now? It's 2.30. Oh my god. Seriously? This guy is horrible with time management. Do you have even oh. the faintest idea how worried I was? And after I told you over and over not to oversleep. Well, you know, I had a lot on my plate last night. Oh? Was it anime? Games? Or were you just tooling around on the internet? Tooling around? Is that really a thing that people say? Uh, all of the above. <laughs> uh, I really shouldn't be surprised at this point. Uh, I'm sorry. Please, please forgive me. Where are you right now? I told you in my email. I'm right by the FOSS map on Main Street. I'm heading there right now. Please, please, please don't leave. Sure, sure. Just don't forget to wash your face before you head out. And brush your teeth. Thanks, Mom. Damn it. I can't believe I did this to him two days in a row. But I've got to hurry. This guy has horrible time management. All right. No time to save. Let's just go ahead and go. I wonder if there's a way to fast travel in this game. I mean, it does have a pretty big map, so I would hope there'd be a way to fast travel, getting around things easier.